All right, boys, so Captain Cheap Ass is back again with his cheap booster boxes. We got some 151. We got this for under $50. But before we get into that, let me show you a lesson of why you don't want to be a cheap guy like me. So I bought this from eBay. I don't know if you guys can see just yet. I mean, it looks like it's, an, what, it's an alternate art booster box Um, because that doesn't look very right to me. Look at the back. Uh, maybe you guys can read that right there. I don't know if you see right there. It says, Sword and Shield, Silver, Tempest, the Lugia V. Uh, there's Charizard. I mean, <laughs> I tried to save $4, guys, and I bought from someone with one feedback. It bit me in the ass. He sent me a box straight from Alibaba. I saw in the tracking. It literally came straight from Alibaba. He didn't even buy it himself. He just drop shipped that to me. Luckily, I've been going back and forth with eBay. The guy finally decided to return to me. I mean, he didn't really have any other option. So take a lesson from your big dog. You don't want to be a cheap ass. Uh, I mean, it works out sometimes, but it, it can really bite you in the ass. So today, we're going to be opening up some 151. You know, I bought, I opened this so uh, my three year old can have this freaking mozzarella boom. Like, Freaking cheap guy over here. I ain't a cheap guy when it comes to my kids, though. I, those, we go into GameStop. She looks me in the eyes and she says, "Daddy, please, I, I need mozzarella boom. I need, I, I need, I need the Quackley figure. I, I, I need this doll. I need, I need Oxbot." I'm like, "Okay, baby, whatever you need. What do you need? What are Daddy gonna get it for you?" So, since I'm spending all my money on her, I'm back out here opening up 151 Korean. Back again with that shitty Korean box, you know. Um. I got this on eBay, another eBay scam, but no, I bought from this guy before. I think I bought the, uh, bought a couple boxes for him, so we're all good here. But um, $45 for a box of 151 I mean, it's eBay, I mean, it's Korean. So you, you saw my last video, you know the Korean quality definitely isn't there. I think we came to the consensus that, you know, that, that's pretty, uh, for what people told me, that's pretty normal. Um, it's just that the Koreans, I don't know, they don't, they don't got enough money for all the extra glue. So their packs just rip right off. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's like, I think if you're collecting, definitely not too bad to get the Koreans. I mean, or, or if you just want to have a, some binder pieces, if you're, if, if you're trying to like invest or your own money, I mean, not the best. And then, uh, okay. So we, <laughs> So this is what I was interested about. Like, I wanted to see the pull right there. I mean, we already got the AR, the Psyduck. I mean, one of my favorite cards in the set. Um, th this last box I opened of 151 Japanese. I mean, that 151 Japanese is like crack to me. I can't stop opening it. I tell myself this is the last booster box. Then I'm at, it's 12, it's 12 a.m. midnight. I'm freaking on the computer. And I'm like, ah, I, oh, maybe I just need another box. <laughs> I'm ordering another one. So, um... This last one I got five ARs in, which is like one out of every four packs was an AR, which is pretty good. I mean, that's, that's about typical from what I found. I usually get about three ARs and one S um, secret rare. So um, yeah, I'm kind of interested in the Korean, how it compares. I haven't really seen any reverses just, okay, so we got a reverse right there. We're looking for that mass. Is that the master ball right there? No. And then I've got, I mean, so far the polls seem pretty good on this one. Um, like if you want 151 i mean and you want to get the ones with like the master balls and stuff and you, you're not looking to spend 150 dollars on a box this korean might be the way to go uh especially if you just want it for your binder and stuff but i mean like quality aside the, i mean the korean cards they look good i mean i don't really see like i said before the whole like fiasco with um <laughs> with the sticker fiasco I, I i thought these korean cards are pretty good i mean they look they look pretty nice to me and for 50 bucks i mean and even as far as investing goes i mean god man that ev heroes now it was like it was like 40 dollars a month ago and now i'm looking at it you're looking at like 70 bucks on ebay for a box of korean ev heroes almost doubling its money so i mean can you really like complain with that if like, you could just buy you could have bought a whole case of them and boom double your money i mean what kind of investment can you do that in but i don't know it's nuts and then um uh, oh by the way mr sakura didn't come through i don't know i've been trying to get him to email me i made a post 
So we're gonna re-roll that ETB, uh, the, bleh, that Evolving Skies ETB. We're gonna re-roll that at the end, guys. So all you lucky people that entered that, you get a second chance. We're gonna see who the winner is. Ho hopefully, <laughs> hopefully whoever wins it this time emails me. So I really hope so. But yeah, I'm kind of bummed about that, but whatever. It's it's what happened. And we got so we're getting, I mean, we've gotten one AR, two EXs so far. It's actually not too bad. I, I'm I'm kind of liking the pull rates on here. I, I was kind of afraid. I thought that maybe it would be kind of like how EV Heroes where EV Heroes was, was was a bummer for me. I mean, I didn't really pull anything in there as far as art rares go. Just got a couple of V's and V Maxes. It was kind of a, a bunk. A bunk box but so far here i mean if we can pull at least like three ar maybe an sr i think that's going to be about on par with japanese i'm kind of i'm looking for that master ball i i, I don't know the korean stuff is like that if, if you're not if you don't really mind maybe a little bit lesser quality product you're just looking to put some uh, pieces in a binder looking to fill out like a master set of 151 I don't really see anything wrong with Korean. I I, I kind of like it for that fact. I mean, you ain't gonna buy. I'm okay. We got like how many? I got like three EXs and a freaking art rare. I I paid basically like two, a little bit over two dollars a pack of this. So freaking one fifty one Japanese. You're talking like seven to ten dollars a pack. It's it's nuts. I I mean, like I said, I love this set. I love collecting it. I bought. I have more boxes that I bought gonna be doing another opening with that so we'll see how it compares to this but i don't know man it, it's just the value on this is insane can't really compete with that so we got the star whatever the flareon but yeah and then uh oh my god it's far and then and then talk about shipping drama so finally i got this ebay taken care of i'm getting my money back there i'm really i was stressing about that i mean i, I knew i was gonna get my money back eventually um some way or another but you know it's always whenever you got money held up like that it's definitely and another freaking ex card like what it's just like every freaking pack is an ex card uh, whenever you got money tied up like that it's super annoying i mean I, I just don't like that i just get stressed out about that and uh so i got the money back there but then now we got the we got the mystery pack saga i mean so I, okay so i was gonna make a video i got a, another my wife she, she wants to waste all my money. You know you know how women are, man. She's like, you need to make another, uh, you need, honey, you need to make another shiny vert video. You need to really see if he's a scammer or not. I'm like, okay, so <laughs> I bought a freaking another $100 box. I bought, this time I bought the his mystery box. It comes with like a plushie and a couple booster packs and I don't know, like a graded card or some something stupid like that. Dude, it's been over two weeks since I since I paid for it. He made the shipping label two weeks ago now. I emailed the guy, freaking. I emailed him twice. I DM'd him on Instagram. No answer. Then I, then finally I'm like, whatever. I'm just gonna like I see this guy posting on Instagram every day. Another ex. Let's go, boys. Like this freaking Korean is loaded. This shit is fucking nuts. So, um, yeah, I'm like, I'm going to just make a post on this guy's thing. Like, I, I'm tired of this. Like, I'm just like, I don't want to, like, go through my bank. Like, what's going on? I just want to get this mystery box, make my video. So, I make one comment, and a couple days go by. I go and look. My comment's deleted. I'm like, what the hell? Like, what is going on? I'm looking for that Master Ball. Is this the Master Ball? I haven't seen the Master Ball yet. I probably, my retard ass probably went by it. But, um, so I make another comment. Guy finally answers me, telling me I didn't delete no comments. Uh, oh yeah, okay, bro. Like, I mean, obviously you did. I know I made the comment, so he uh, he says just just e just emails again. I didn't get no emails. I email him again. Then he del and then he deletes my comment again. I mean, I, I figure okay, you don't want the drama on your page. That's all good. I I'm not really too worried about that. I got the Gengar. Um, email him again. Finally, they get back to me, telling me. Uh, so he made a shipping label, but it just says like. Uh, they have UPS hasn't received the package yet. So he tells me, Oh, um, yeah, we talked to UPS. It was a miscan. Like you, you should be getting it delivered as normal. I, I, I what do you mean as normal? I, I'm gonna stay away from you. What what's normal? It's been two weeks, big dog. 
And um, oh, oh, if you're worried about it, you can uh, make a claim at uh, a missing package claim. I go on and look. It's like, I can't even make a missing package claim with a package that doesn't say it's not even shipped out yet. Like, are you retarded? So now I'm having to threaten them with doing a charge back in my bank. I, I That was yesterday, so I don't know. They still haven't gotten back to me. I'm going to have to contact Wells Fargo today. Okay, so we got the gold energy. So, I mean... So we got one secret rare and one art rare so far. We got two more packs left. I don't know. That's mm, we got a lot of EXs, but that's kind of a it's a little low for my taste. I mean, Japanese are gonna do a little bit better. Let's see. Maybe these are both hitters. So yeah. So there might not be any shining vert video. I mean, I think the case is out right now. This guy. I don't know what. I don't know what kind of drugs that guy's smoking over there. What he's on. He, I don't know, man. It just, it's really disappointing. Okay, we got the Snorlax. So maybe both of these are hitters. That's got the Snorlax AR. Love that card. I mean, these, the cards look sick. You know what I mean? If you want to get the cards, you want to get the artworks. Korean is definitely, I, you ain't going to get a cheaper option than that. I could, get, I could get three Korean booster boxes for the price of 151. So, but yeah, we'll see. I'm hoping he, get, I, I really hope he just gets back to me today. He figures it out. I told him, just figure it out. Let, let me know. If you can't figure it out, I'm just going to have to do a chargeback in my bank, big dog. I don't know what to tell you. And okay, so yeah. So it ended up being stock standard, what I thought. Um, three ARs, one SR. Got a boatload of freaking EXs over here. Let me see if I can. I got like, there's a pile of these freaking. Like, look at all these hits, man. Just EX, EX, gold, art rare. So, as you guys can see, I mean, Korean, it's pretty sick. You got a lot of hits. The quality might not be up there with English or Japanese. Doesn't look too bad. Like I said, if you're looking to complete a binder, you're looking to complete a master set, I definitely would check out the Korean. Get a whole case of, you probably get a whole case of Korean for like the price of two um for less than the price of two japanese booster boxes so i don't know definitely a good option um let's go ahead and re-roll that giveaway see who our winner is let's do it boys all right guys look we got it going let's see come on let's, who do we got and we got let's go right there we uh, jim you're a winner jim go ahead and email me jim Pikachu surf shack at gmail.com. Make sure you get out to me. I'm gonna give you I'm <laughs> anyone who wants this giveaway, I don't, I'm gonna give it away until someone emails me. You got a week, Jim. I hope you get I mean I see you comment on my thing, so I'm pretty sure you should get back to me. Uh just email me, give me a picture of your manage page of, of your like with your uh, screenshot of your name, and we'll get that out to you, Jim. And I hope everyone else has a humongous dunga day and let's do it, boys.